What's up, guys? It's your boys, and we'll keep back with another Goose Pimple Sunday! And yes, it's a little bit later in the evening, but I've been doing a lot of around the house, obviously being a parent and obviously an adult first. So I have to do that stuff first. Plus, the new Sam of Kobe came out, so I had to watch that one first. And then the Sam's, or the Goose Pimples came out. So I'm just definitely a little behind. But with that being said, with you guys watching, we're going to watch Goose Pimples still on a Sunday. So with that being said, grab a chair, grab some popcorn, because we are about to get in shock from the... In for the, the creepiness, the scariness, that's all in real life because that's what Goose Pimple says we're, it's gonna happen. So with that being said, grab a chair, guys, pop, pop, or popcorn as we watch this together and get scared and be shocked. Let's take a look. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe down below by hitting the red bar icon down at the bottom right. Smack that bell icon next to it so when I do post a video like this one, you'll get that little ring notification that Smokey we'll myself has posted that video. And then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, I thank you guys so very much for the continued love and support you show on this channel every single day. Keep on doing what you guys are doing. Tell your friends and your family and we'll grow even bigger in 2022. But that being said, we're here for Goose Pimples. And speaking of support, make sure you guys check out the link in the description for Goose Pimples themselves. Go over there, give them some love, do the thanks, subscribe, comment, like, and share. They are at 66,000 subscribers. We are trying to help them out and get to their goal of 100,000 subscribers and get them that play button. So go over there, give them some love. And without further ado, let's get a video and see the five scare videos in real life. You'll be shocked. Let's take a look. The following scary videos were uploaded on TikTok by Bailey, the caretaker of an allegedly haunted theatre. On his first day of training, <laughs> theatre staff this pretty warned creepy. him of strange happenings littered throughout the building, and he was raring to go as soon as he heard it all. He didn't catch much when he first started recording, until a viewer suggested sitting down quietly with his phone. Oh my gosh. And that night, while looking after the theatre alone, he decided to try it out. And that's when he managed to capture this. What? If this is gonna jump out of me, I swear to baby Jesus. Somebody in the... Who's that? That ahead? It's moving. You see it up in the loft? Is it clapping? Why is it always potato quality? Something was leering over the edge of the balcony towards him. Oh, he swears MJ. blind he was alone that night. As creepy as it was, this clip doesn't show too much, so we decided to do a little bit more investigation. And while responding to an intruder alarm, he caught something spine tingling. This place just has a creepy aura. So apparently that's the ghost light, they leave it on for the ghosts. Someone in here? Hello? Oh, that's creepy as it is. Fuck, 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 fuck. Somebody playing the piano? Hey. You're not supposed to be in here. Who? Who is it? Shh. What are we looking at? Oh, hell no. Either there's a very musical rubber, or there's something spooky lurking around that piano. But Bailey, yet again swears that he was the only one around. After this, he decided the nighttime activity He's wasn't there enough, by himself. so he began searching for activity in daylight. All right, y'all, my heart Finally is caught okay, on so camera, okay. I see this sometimes, I've been trying to catch this on camera. Nothing over here, I promise there's nothing over here. I'm not doing anything to manipulate this. Watch. Look, you see that? That could be a draft. This is what I'm talking about, okay, check it out. I'm gonna get another one. Look, I'm not doing anything, I swear. I'm just standing here. I see this all the time. I feel like it's like a draft. It only happens. Ooh, okay, yeah, see? It only happens at this. Okay, I feel like it's a draft, though. Seen it. Holy shit. Looks like Aladdin left his carpet behind. 
Bailey was getting more tense as the activity seemed to ramp up. He began to struggle catching specific moments, but he got lucky with this next clip. Look at a dark area. Oh, I, was, I saw the head. Backstage, can't see it very well, but. Um, Did you see the head? The head was what? poking out. <gasps> Look, guys, holy shit. I'm turning the lights on, I'm turning the lights on. Holy crap, what? The light moved? Are we not going to talk about the head that we just saw? A right figure side? seems to be creeping around the backstage doorway. He hears some light. Okay, we see this one. But what about this one? I'm here. Light footsteps before the stage light shudders on its own. You see Soon two of them. Soon after seeing this apparition, Bailey began to hear singing from the main stage. Oh my god! He turns off the lights and hides in the back in hopes of catching it on camera. And what happened next? made his hair stand on it. It's like a paranormal punch in the face galore. I'm chilled. Oh my gosh. Something is definitely having a sing song. Oh, my while legs it have alone. ghost pebbles but who, everywhere. Or what the hell is it <sighs> when Bailey is the only one supposed to be looking after the theatre? Oh my night? gosh. A few comments point out that somebody could be hiding out of sight True. and wailing into the abyss. But it's still but Bailey seems a little bit too invested <clears throat> for that to be the case. Another commenter asked Bailey to compliment the singing, but did that make him a friend or an enemy? Let's find out. Your voice is pretty. Thank you. Now, a few <gasps> comments pointed out that this sounded a little suggestive. But if you listen closely, it sounds thankful almost relieved that someone can hear it. The activity died down for a little yeah. while after this, but it was nowhere near the end. The security alarm got set off again, and Bailey charged towards the commotion, oh my and what he saw shocked him to his core. Look, it's doing me right now. Hello. All right. We have all these mannequin heads right there. Is this that Anyone shower? I think the shower goes on. The bathroom. The shower turns on and sends chills up my spine. Whoa. Someone's in here. That's a creepy bathroom, man. Yo, it's midnight. Ha, I would not go in there. I'm telling you that right now. I would let it be and go home. You. See, I don't trust that. I know there's nobody behind it. Phone starts to glitch. Someone behind that. <laughs> okay. All right. Um. This place chills chills me out, man. Let's see. Oh, there's got to be somebody down here. Let's go the other way. I'm just waiting to see a figure. Yo, these lights were off. Yes, they were. Hello? Someone in here, seriously. Fuck. 
Kiss Going French. all the way down to the basement at midnight is a fate worse than death yeah, according amen to, to that all one. horror movies. But Bailey seems to power on through. That is, Balls until he hears the shower turn on by itself. And as he tries to turn the water off, his phone begins to glitch. He paces back towards the centre of the basement, where he noticed all of the lights had been turned on. But after that, he still had more to come. Check out this short but scary video that Bailey caught on the main stage. See that? Yeah. Look oh, closely that at curtain the doorway, moved. right behind him, just behind the curtain, you can see something sprinting past. <laughs> Looks like, like a woman. Are, as always, if the sensor gets tripped, I film it, just in case we see anything. So here we go. It's uh, 9 p.m. on a Saturday. This is my life. So I'm walking through the main stage. <clears throat> yeah, I'll flip it. Okay. Ghost light. Ghost light is on. No one in here. Hello. Okay. Oh! <gasps> Standing there. Two figures, ah! as day, stood atop the balcony. Soon they'll be asking Bailey to sing for them. Oh, it's so yeah, clear! This, uh, I just paint. I swear, like I my bands. Noise. It's a really beautiful theater, as you can see, if you can see it at all. Oh hell! I keep hearing a noise in here, and there's not supposed to be anybody here, so just. I actually just thing, I to accidentally it. sharded myself. Just in case. Oh my gosh. The ghost light, it's the light we keep on for <sighs> ghosts, <laughs> for people who still remain here and whatnot. And um, in, the, in the balcony, right side. What the fuck? Yeah. WTF. Ha <laughs> ha. What is that? <gasps> you see his face? He's wearing, he's wearing a flipping tie, man. Do you see the tie? Just before the camera abruptly cuts off, you can see someone or something sizing Bailey up from across the theatre, and they seem to be pushing him further and oh further towards the edge. But what do you think? Is he safe working there? Do you think he should have Googled <laughs> that theatre before applying for the job? At least after doing his online research, he wouldn't have to worry this much, as long as he had NordVPN. Having NordVPN oh, offers gosh. ultimate online security. Ghost hunting gone Never wrong. Oh, okay. There's a reason why you don't see ghost hunters doing a paranormal investigation completely alone at night. Because when you a do, lot of they are doing it nowadays. Happens. It's actually creepier when you do it alone. 잠깐 실례 좀 하겠습니다. 잠깐이면 됩니다. 조금만 아주 조금만 들어보고 나갈게요. 아주 Some something's moving. 아주 조금만 the 들어보고 나갈게요. 죄송합니다. Sound like just like that. Is that a rice cooker? What is that? It's a lot of. Oh wow. Hey, 바람이지? 바람이야 바람. That's the wind. Hey, 바람이다. 바람이잖아. 왜 그래? That's not the wind. <웃음> 바람이 바람 여러분 여기 바람이다 여기 하지 말고 바람이 바람. 어? Hello. 
Get you. Something's there. Do it again. Please don't jump out. I can't deal with something jumping out tonight. Creepy stairs. It's a lot of stuff on that stairs. I feel like something's gonna jump out. Oh, the suspense is killing me. Oh my gosh! Bring a friend. What? Is it hitting that glass? Shaking the cabinet. What is that? Is that a bush snipper? What are you doing? After hearing some strange noises oh coming gosh. from the inside of this allegedly haunted house, Ooh, the that was killing me. decides to wander around for a few minutes. But when he reaches out to the doorknob, the furniture around it begins to shake, as if warning him to leave. But he is very stubborn and decides to continue his paranormal investigation. Will he remain brave enough for what happens next, though? Let's is he gonna see out. something? Does he go? Oh, he goes back, obviously. Uh oh, is that a shrine? What is that? It's just a wall. A bedroom. You think it's gonna listen? <sighs> and they have some creepy stuff. I heard that. Oh. Is that a knife? Like a saw. It's like a wood uh tree saw. Why would it be in a bedroom? Just leave it alone. What are you doing? Eh? What? Oh, something's gonna happen. Oh, it's gonna happen. Oh. Do you see string? I don't see no string. What? <gasps> Have mercy. What is it showing? <laughs> that shut that shut more. How on earth did that cabinet door open by itself? You, you see and of course, after that, he couldn't stay in the house for another second. 
Good. Go home. So much for wanting to be a solo oh ghostbuster. Oh my gosh. Number three. That was suspenseful. Antiques show. Sometimes, store security cameras catch the stuff we would rather not know about. Check clip posted by Barnsley Antique Center. <laughs> oh! Either there was something extremely wrong with the air that day, or there was something spooky I've going I've heard that high frequencies can do that though too. footage from a different angle. But it's not just the cabinets taking a beating either. Oh. According to the channel, that lamp was pretty heavy, so there's no way it could have fallen on its own, unless someone pushed it. Huh. But they also claim that the shop was empty that night. And to be honest, who would be inside an antiques shop at four o'clock in the morning? Yeah, no kidding. And they just kept catching paranormal activity day after day. Watch, one of those little antique things is haunted. The actual divot boxes, little hutches and stuff, dolls, hello. <coughs> oh, there According is no way for that to happen. That picture frame was okay, maybe fixed it. onto a brass hook. So what the hell yanked it off? Next, another picture fell off of its rack. Only this time, people were around, and their reactions seem pretty genuine. Seems genuine. They're all clearly oh, dumbfounded, sorry, guys. but they couldn't figure out how the picture fell at all. All they could do was stare blankly at one another. Here's another clip of what happened with some customers in store. It's like a first, metal frame. It seems like it could just be the breeze, but after all the activity that we've already watched, we can't rule out the paranormal either. And so then, many as items if it in there. Get any worse? The toys got involved. Of course, it's probably a doll. Oh, look! There's a stormtrooper in there. Or clone. Not stormtrooper. Sorry. Star Wars clone. Uh, looks like one of those. Rocking. Or stingy, but looks like a deer. Oh, yep, it's one of those rocking things. Watch, look at that chest right there. That's just reeking of paranormalness. Blanket Apparently, chest. The shop yeah, owner okay. found Bambi on the floor and thought it was best to rewind the CCTV footage to see what happened. At exactly 2:59 a.m., the toy rocked until it clattered to the ground. But the weirdest was still yet to come. More? You got a little Betty Boop in there. She could be haunted. Oh, what is that? That's a bug. That was just a bug right there. You could see that was a bug. Was this proof of fairies and orbs? Or just proof that the building really needs an extermination team. Extermination. We'll leave it up to you to decide. That looks like a gigantic mosquito. Paranormal Believers. Me! Hey. Indian trail trees have a rich history. Culturally modified, these trees have a distinctive <coughs> horizontal bent and were used throughout the North American wilderness years ago. Really? The sacred nature of these trees, and the grounds that they inhabit, strike fear into many these days. Especially over on the YouTube channel Geek Girls. Geek Girls. They believe they may have desecrated one of these trees by carving into it years uh -huh. ago. You and that it up, may be yeah. the reason behind the supposed paranormal activity they have been witnessing for years. And when you look into this guy's history, you can see why he's so superstitious. In 2004, I was an embedded tactical trainer. Okay. We were looking to set up an Afghan uh, base. My Afghan soldiers were living in tents in Jalalabad. We had these two old Soviet barracks we were looking at remodeling. When we were reviewing the photos, we noticed a whole bunch of orbs and a white shadowy mist. These were not visible to our naked eyes and only showed up after we reviewed our digital photos. Take it as you will, the orbs might just be dust. 
but it was a bright sunny day and I had no explanation for the shadowy, the ghostly mists that were seen in the camera. Probably had the whole told though. me many people died on this ground and uh, they were afraid of going in these buildings. These may be haunted barracks. So naturally, when his daughter started noticing some Oh, I came home toilets, with him! He jumped at the chance to conduct a little paranormal investigation. Oh no! It came home with him. Let's get a move. Haunted doll? What are you gonna do? It's boot or his foot is like weird. It's gonna turn its head. Oh! Oh! Her head turns ever so slightly. And it's not just the American girl Time dolls that, that doll. are moving. Justin Bieber's also performing for the camera. What? This is uh Justin Bieber doll <coughs> that my daughters like to play with in the bathtub. They make him swim around. I'm not a fan, but my daughters say he moves by himself. I took one video earlier today, and uh, after reviewing it, it actually looked like he was moving. Um, Is this Toy Story? I'm gonna try it again from a different angle to see if I can get a cl more closer to see what's going on. Again, it's just your normal Justin Bieber plastic Barbie-like sort of like Ken doll, but. Oh, I'm wearing black underwear. Okay, um, I'm gonna put him down in the same area where my daughters say he moves around and we'll see what happens. But I'm gonna try to put this time again, you see there's no wires, there's no anything. Just a regular bathtub. Um, nothing fishy around here. This is showing um, us that. You know, I'm not sure. I hate this, this isn't really Sometimes it doesn't really focus or focus on, on something, I don't know. But you can see regular bathroom, nothing funky. Um, I'm gonna do what I did before. Turn on the water, I don't know why, but it only happens supposedly when the water's running. So the running you know, water you gives the vortex or something crazy, who knows? Power. All right, I'm gonna try to do it close so you can see Justin Bieber. Um, again, there's no wires, no nothing, nothing funky. Put the water on and try to get a close up so this is. I don't want to fall so in case it's not so much camera. I'm putting it down. Um, okay, um, I'm gonna go out here, close the door, and see what happens. What the actual F? Oh! Turn it off! I feel like he's gonna be like, ah! Yeah. All right, I can't really tell if it's moved. Um, kind of does kind of look like it moved. I mean, and I'm not turning off the camera or anything. There's nothing here. So. It looks like someone grabbed the doll oh, and slid it across slid the bathtub, it and it seems as though this poltergeist has an affliction with teen heartthrobs. Look what it did with One Direction. Okay, so we've been having some uh, activity again in the bathroom. Uh, <coughs> Look at the whole band! Been moving things. Was that NSYNC? Backstreet uh, Boys? This is a tub um, where my daughters take a bath. And these are some of their dolls. Um, and not using a Justin Bieber doll, 
Um, we had some activity even last night. My wife was in the tub. Um, we don't have a tub at her master bath. And uh, um, my wife felt something kind of stroking her hair. But what I'm going to show you with these dolls, I'm going to set these up over here. This um, entity seems to like playing with... Uh, All I can see is like this becoming something where the, the NSYNC boys go, Bye, 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 bye. <laughs> Um, male dolls more than female dolls because my daughters have Barbies too. So I have one. Was it One Direction? Here, <laughs> I knew it. You know, I knew Louis, it was One Direction. Hey, um, Niall. I don't know all these guys. I guess Harry. Um, so I have them all set up over Hold here. Hold on. I'm going to show you. That, look, there's the previous Justin Bieber. Nobody's in the tub. Um, you see, when you pick them up, put them down. Um, other people said, hey, he's got strings, but look, there's no string. There is no, no string. strings. Oops, let me put these back. Um, no strings, no nothing. All right, these guys are back up. <coughs> I've never listened um, to One Direction, so I have no idea what they sing. So I'm going to keep it all in the frame. I'm going to keep them in the frame at all times so you can see there's nothing weird going on. Um, just me here in my daughter's bathroom with these dolls. That is weird, but... Um, so we're going to ask some questions. Girl man in a room with the um, One Direction dolls. And see if anything moves. Is there anybody here with us? No. All right, hold on. Let me get this, everything settled so I can get them all. Hold on. Let me, let me put this camera down. That was weird. Something just kind of knocked into me, um, when I was asking a question. Um, so let me stabilize this thing and let me keep everything in the frame. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on while I get this. All right, I've washed my thumbs. Here we go. Uh, almost, almost, almost. It's the guy on the left. Almost. Almost there. Bear with me now. Fix the dang um, camera. Just getting this, getting this here. There we uh, go. I think I got it. All right. Is there anybody here with us? Watch them all. Are there any entities here with us? If you are, oh. uh, all right, they're here. Um, dolls moved. Something's going on here. Um, <coughs> something's really going on here. Um, are you dead? Are Are you dead? Uh, I guess you. Are, uh, all right. So that means yes. If you move the dolls. Did you die in this house? No. Take that as a uh, no. Did you <laughs> die near this house? These mother effers came. Oh. Uh, doll moved. I'll take that as a uh, yes. Um, are you one years old? Two. Nothing. Are you two years old? Nothing. Oh. What? Two years old? Are you two years old? Are you three years old? And now you're saying you're three years old. Are you saying you're four years old because two plus two? Knock into the dolls again if you're saying you're four years old. A child ghost? Well, let's try a different question. Are you Native American? Like a... Like a tribe used to be there? Are you Native American? Like they built over... Oh gosh, burial ground. Take that as a no. Uh, oh. Maybe. Um... Were you murdered? Were you murdered? Uh, uh, I'm done here. Looks that like this entity by wanted to cut question time short. Number one. Hell no. House of Horrors. Sorry. YouTube channel Ouija Brothers Ouija decided Brothers? to investigate the UK's most haunted abandoned house. 1893. Shout out to them for having some of the most genuine paranormal footage on YouTube, by the I feel way. feel like I've seen them before. It all started a few weeks before while investigating this very house but they decided to bail after hearing violent hissing echoing throughout the room. I would too. So of course, they had to return. 
Upon entering the house, and seeing the absolute shambles it was in, they thought it was a great idea to split up and investigate, and the footage idea. they captured was pretty convincing. Could you give me a word? Could you give me a name? Was that you? No. What the hell was that? You, or he? No. Could you give me a word? Could you give me a name? Was that you? No. Could you give me a word? Could you give me a name? There's nothing here. Let me just show you quickly. Is that a stairway? Stairwell? There's nothing in front of me. What is it? Ah! Chase! Something I've just heard right fucking now. running. You are. I've just heard running. Oh, it's cold there. Yeah. Shuffled on the bottom. I don't know if it was a rat. I don't know. I, I, I didn't see anything, but I heard it. Now, a few seconds ago, I, I, um. <laughs> that was a good scream, though. No, because I heard something walking to look. It sounded like something was walking towards me. And then no word of it, I heard something like dun, 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 dun. Which way did it run? If you had to put a guess on it. That way. To well, your right. It's into here. It, it, it didn't come towards me. Hello? It but it holy like shit, it. that was loud. Angel. You can hear it. I thought I was now, running around. If that um, was a rat making that noise, it would have had to be in a rat in a pair of stilettos. Uh, yeah. And as if the bumps and bangs weren't enough, the Ghost Tube app started spouting some of the creepiest combinations of words we've ever heard. So, I don't understand where we've got that noise from. Loads of wasps, loads of dead wasps. Love them. I'm glad you've heard what I heard. Weird walking noise, yeah. but it wore a rodent. I couldn't put it down as a rodent. It was, um, it was, it's light, weren't it? It was light, but it was the circumference of a foot. Hello? Anybody here at all? We just need to know, because we just heard walking. Am I dead, father? Am I dead, father? Basement. I mean, sometimes they feel like they're not dead. Devil. Man, it's all coming out. There's a devil in the basement. We gotta get down there. It's time to go. Devil and basement. It's just basement. basement. Devil basement. We've gotta go. And father. Hearing the words basement devil would intrigue you too. So the guys head down to check it out, but as soon as they step foot down those stairs, they hear something that sends them spiralling. No. Come on, get out of here. So that was fucking loud. Hello? Is that you? We were upstairs. I got boom. Come on, get out of here. And when they run to investigate, they get this. Oh my god, fucking. Goodbye. Thank God, goodbye. 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 See you in a bit. How about that? So they thought it was wise to call it a day. Make sure you subscribe to the Weezy oh, Brothers. Oh, I have to go check them if out. Want the real deal. But sit tight because today we bring you a bonus video. Yes! Our bonus video was sent over by one of our viewers, Lakey. His son saw something utterly unexplainable in the fine. sky. Check it out. What's that? So I'm zooming. Like an asteroid? What is that? No, it's like a floating puffball. What the? Like a daddy lion, but huge. 
huge. That is weird. What the flip is that? If somebody sits there and says that's a dang weather balloon, I swear to baby Jesus. What is that? Or a flock of birds. It's like a big cloud in the middle, or in front, and then a light is behind it. No. What the flip? Josh, what's your language? That's a son of a biscuit moment. Yeah, watch your language. That's a son of a biscuit moment right there. And it doesn't dissipate. Let's go. It's like a UFO. Mm. Unidentified. Well, it's not flying. It's like floating. What is that? It's still there, but very faint. Yeah, it's sunk near the road. Oh, there it is. What is that circle thing? The floating thing? object looks like a tiny cloud. But it seemed to be followed by something shiny. Yeah. We're no UFO specialists, but this is certainly strange. Was it an orb? A star? A comet? A cloud? Something. Let us know what you think in I the don't comment know what it section. Is. Comment down below. Hi, uh, Easter egg at the end for you. I apologize for my voice in this. I am a little bit sick <laughs> right now. <laughs> I hope it's okay though. That's okay. <laughs> Searching for something else to scratch that spookfest itch? Well, we have just the video for you. Click here to watch it now. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon to avoid missing our weekly spookfest. Thanks for watching. Stay in the dark. Woo! Definitely another one. Great one by Goose Pimples. I definitely enjoyed it again. Make sure you guys also go over there to their channel and subscribe. Again, like I said before, go over there, give them some love, tap that bell icon as well and of course hit the like button and uh, we'll see you guys in the next video so keep it real keep it safe and as always keep learning on and we'll see you guys next time